I should be thrilled that the word somatic is super popular right now, but instead I'm kind of apprehensive because it really has lost, I think, the meaning that you're actually looking for. So this is a little bit of a rant. Somatic only means relating to the body, but the field of somatic education is actually a field of several different studies of how to engage a person in the deepest sense of their sensory world, the connection between thinking, moving, feeling, acting. So yes, it regulates the nervous system, but it also does way more than that. And it's not just simply moving slow. It's actually more complex in the way that we ask questions of people, ask them to do movement experience experiments. Pioneers in this work of somatic education, F.M. Alexander with the Alexander Technique, Moshe Feldenkrais with the Feldenkrais Method, uh, Continuum, Emily Conrad, Bonnie Brainbridge Cohen, Body Mind Centering. So now you see there's really actual fields with decades of advancements going on under the, field, under the term somatic education. Th Thomas Hanna, somatics. Now, you're seeing somatic workout, somatic exercise, somatic yoga, somatic Pilates. And all it means is relating to the body. It's not from this other field that I think is what you're actually searching for. So do your Pilates, do your yoga, do your workouts. But if what you want to do is recover from pain, injury, limitation, emotional distress, uh, and you're not primarily already healthy and just looking to get healthier, come to the Feldenkrais Method. If you're looking to improve your performance, come to the Feldenkrais Method. If you're looking to train your nervous system so that it can go up and down according to the needs, come to the Feldenkrais Method. If you're looking to get beyond trauma, beyond the therapy that you've been doing and really reclaim your life, come to the Feldenkrais Method. I've got a three live part series, three part live series coming up. So check it out. And uh, I'd love to have you. And I want to give you a taste of the true somatic education approach, which is so much more about inquiry and respect and letting go of any ideas of what we're going to get from the work and letting the unconscious parts of yourself really take it in and use it to your highest good. I hope to see you.